So Palantir just came out with an important announcement because they officially have a new platform which is called Chain Reaction and it's currently being marketed as the operating system for American AI infrastructure. A pretty prestigious title, but it's basically a complete operating system built to power the future of compute. And as the title of this article stated, NVIDIA and Centerpoint Energy have both partnered with Palantir to build out the next era of data centers. Honestly, this is going to be a pretty massive undertaking. Here's the real idea behind all this though. AI is no longer bottlenecked by algorithms. We have plenty of models that are accelerating extremely fast and are getting specialized at different kinds of tasks. We also have plenty of training techniques and a lot of intelligent people pushing this forward. But what we don't have enough of is power. The AI and infrastructure that actually lets these AI workloads run fast and efficiently. So this is exactly what Chain Reaction is built to address the energy grid level demands of the next era. In fact, there are four key missions this platform is trying to solve. The first being to modernize old power plants and maximize their uptime to keep AI's growing energy demand. Second, they want to stabilize and expand the grid. Third, accelerate the construction of new energy and compute infrastructure. And finally, design hyperscale data centers from the ground up. So yeah, it's software that helps manage and accelerate the development of power generation, grid stability, and data center construction. Coming back to Palantir's partners though, let's actually start with Centerpoint Energy, because they're one of the biggest gas and electric utilities in the United States. They serve about 7 million customers and are now using Palantir for tasks like storm response and grid visibility. But to me, it's pretty obvious that their main goal is literally to accelerate energy development. Keep in mind though, this is a utility that expects Houston's energy consumption to increase by 50% in the next 5 years and double by the mid 2030s. So they need both speed and power, and they chose Palantir to help deliver it. And then there's Nvidia, which doesn't need an introduction. But you may remember that they recently partnered with Palantir on operational AI deployments. But now they're going even deeper, using Chain Reaction to streamline the rollout of NVIDIA's AI infrastructure across America. And this includes massive gigawatt scale buildouts, AI factories, and hyperscale data centers. So if you're wondering how Chain Reaction fits into all this, it's gonna help to coordinate all the physical and digital supply chains required to manufacture intelligence at an insane scale. And when I say manufacturing intelligence, I literally mean that. That's what this movement is all about. Aside from making a f load of money, I think this whole AI revolution we're currently experiencing though is as much about smarter models as it is about real world energy systems that'll be propping up the entire thing. And of course, whether you like it or not, AI is becoming the backbone of how civilization runs. Palantir sees it, Nvidia sees it, this guy sees it, and even Australia sees it. Check out this video next to see how Palantir opened up an entirely new market and revenue stream for themselves in the land down under. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.